I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will review the concept of finding equation of tangent line to circle at a given point. The question is equation of tangent line to circle at a given point. The equation given to us is x square plus y square minus 6x minus 8y equals to 0 and the point given to us is 0, 0. Now first step is to find the center of this circle. Some of you who understand this formula fairly well could say that the center, let's say C, will be at negative half of this value Zx. So negative means it becomes positive and half is 3. Negative half of y value coefficient is 4. Now how do you really find this value if you don't know this technique? You could actually complete the squares and find it. So let me show you complete square process. So we'll do that to find center. If we have x square, bring x terms together, minus 6x. And y square minus 8y equals to 0. To complete the squares, we have to add square of half of the coefficient of x. So we get x square minus 6x, and that is 3 square, right? Half of 6 is 3, so we'll add 3 square here. And we'll do the same on the right side, so we'll do 3 square here. Add 3 square both sides. We have y square minus 8y. Half of 8 is 4, so we'll add 4 square, is it okay? So we'll add 4 square on both the sides. Now as you can see, these three terms form a perfect square and that also forms a perfect square. So we can write this as x minus 3 whole square plus y minus 4 whole square equals to 9 plus 16 is 25 which is 5 square radius is 5. Do you see that? So we get the center as 3, 4 as we had predicted. Perfect. So 3, 4 is the center. So let me just make a circle here. Okay. Now this circle has a, has a center which is at 3, 4 and the radius is 5, right? So, so this circle has a center at 3, 4. The point given to us is kind of origin. So let's say, let's say that's the, uh, that's the origin. Okay. So from here, three units to the right and four. Okay, let me make the axis so that it helps us out. Since the tangent we have to find is at the origin, we'll do like this. Is it okay? Okay. So these are rough sketches, but they will help you to understand the concept. So the tangent is at this point. Is it okay? Let's say this is my tangent. Perfect. So that is the situation. You need to find equation of this tangent line. So let's call this line as LT. To find the equation of this tangent line, we'll connect center with the given point, which is 0, 0. Let's call this point uh, center as C. So the steps involved are very simple, as you know. We will first find slope of OC, so let's say slope M of OC the formula is y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 now the point is 3, 4, this is 0, 0, 0, so we can write this as 4 minus 0 over 3 minus 0, so it is 4 over 3 how about the slope of tangent line so tangent slope, uh, which we'll call as mt, negative reciprocals, minus 3 over 4. Is it okay? Since it is perpendicular, right? So it is perpendicular. Let's write like this. Perpendicular, negative reciprocal. So we know the slope of this line m is minus 3 over 4. Makes sense. Going downwards. In that case, what is the equation of length? tangent line lt? So equation will be y equals to slope is minus 3 over 4, x plus b. To find the value of b, we can use the point, which is origin. 
so so is b is zero right so minus anyway uh, times zero equals plus b so we get b as zero right once you know b then you can write down the equation as y equals to minus 3 over 4 x plus 0 is it okay so that becomes the equation of the line in slope intercept form you may write it in standard form also let me multiply by 4 we get 4y equals to minus 3x or 3x plus 4y equals to 0 so that becomes the equation in standard form anyway it's kind of important to review all this and therefore I'm writing my answer in both the forms correct so I hope you find these steps simple and interesting and I hope you like it if you really do you can put some likes on my video of course you can always share my videos with your friends write comments and all the best thank you